And we are back on the Loveland Report. Me, Cleve Loveland, and the Lona Ranger. His first mortgage he carved out in stone tablets right next to Moses. And I have been selling real estate in Central Florida. One of these rooftops on your street, most likely I've helped buy it, I helped sell it, or I manage an investment property. We're answering all your real estate questions. And I got a couple of emails here, Bruce, I want to get to. This is the big one I get this time of year. Uh, this week's Thanksgiving. Um, people say, oh, don't things slow down. I just took, I just took eight listings last right. week, you know, and it's like, it, it's, it's up, up, up North. Yes. But in snowbirds, yes, they don't come down. They might come down for vacation. They don't usually buy cause then they got to go back up North and sell their home. But we don't traditionally we're selling about 4,500 homes a month is our average, not including new construction. So that's like 9,000 buyers and sellers running around out there during the winter. It might slow down to about 8,000. Yeah. But you know 7, what? I think it's actually your best time to get aggressive yeah. on selling your home we, because you got the snow. We're not fighting. Down. Yeah. We're not fighting mm-hmm. snow drifts and things like that. And up North they do. We talk to our friends up there selling real estate and doing mortgages and they do slow down a little bit, but this is not the time to worry about that. Another email I get also, this is one thing I am just firmly, firmly against. It's an email. This guy's asking how much does it cost me to stage my home? And here's what I give you. When I come see your house, I'll give you a 50 point staging checklist. And most of this is, Check the light bulbs, dust the ceiling fans, clean the windows, get rid of the clutter, um, empty the garage out, get a storage unit, have a garage sale, do an estate sale, uh, paint that green wall light gray, things like that. I am firmly against professionally paid stagers who most of the time are unemployed realtors who could not make it in real estate, so now they want to rent you furniture. And that's real, that's how I firmly believe about it. <laughs> a house will sell if it's marketed correctly, if it's staged correctly. You don't need to pay somebody seven hundred dollars, three thousand dollars a month. Now, an empty builder Most of the spec time, home. It's just cleaning it out. Too. It's just cleaning it out, setting it up, neutralizing it, getting the family gallery off the walls. You know, you got fifty pictures of the, all the family vacations. You don't want that on there. Buyers have ADD, but profe- paying somebody to stage your home. And what's funny is Bruce. They come on strong in slow markets. And then they might actually have to, oh, we've got people that will professionally babysit your home, and they collect the rent from them, right. and they just sit in your house and make it look pretty for when people come to show it. When a house is priced right, call me. I will get you sold. I'm selling homes in less than a couple of weeks. Uh, we're getting multiple offers on and them. And you'll get more money than these iBuyer companies. Yes, that too. That's a whole different thing. So what else you got going on this week, Bruce? Well, I've got a lot of things happening right, th- right now. I want you to make note of our class that we're holding. We're doing our wealth building a home buyer class on December 1st. You must register in advance at webringyouhome.com. If you have, if you are currently renting, it's, it's a no brainer. If you don't get in it, you're making a huge mistake. I'm just going to tell you flat out, you're making a huge mistake. If you own a home and you want to learn how to invest in real estate, the easiest possible way to do it. There's no other easier way to do it. You must enroll in this class. I only have a hundred seats available. It's a zoom we will do it. It'll be at six o'clock on December 1st, but you must register in advance and download material so you can follow through with it. Now we're committed to helping folks get into a home by new year's. Let's just say you're at least out looking at what property looks like right now. What type of price range could I be in? What do I qualify for? What type of loan programs are available for me? Can I get in for 3%? 3.5%, 5% down? Do you have 20% to put down? You want to know your options and what those payments look like. Hire a professional. Hire somebody that cares about you. Hire somebody, hire me, because I'm a local business. I care deeply about my clients. I would never, ever, ever steer somebody in the wrong direction, period. I would back out of a transaction rather than try to convince somebody to do a mortgage that they should not do. And I see that in my industry all the time. It's like the people that call you, they're at 4.125% in the 15th year of a 30 year mortgage. I don't know. know, I just find that a lot of people are convinced to do things. Listen, you want a friend in the business that you can count on. I'm applying for the job. You can count on me. I promise you, you'll get the right information. I'll take great care of your kids, your family, your retirement. I can help you build that equity in homes and get the right mortgage to do that. That's what I'm here to do, and I promise that you'll get that. I'm in the same location for 20 years, right here at Fairbanks and I-4. Yep. Um, I have closed well over 10,000 transactions now, and I, you know what? I'm still going strong. Yeah. I am not, I'm not backing down right now. Well, your team's I'm, wonderful to deal with, and just and knowing that I know when I send you a loan, you rescue a couple orphaned loans every month because I'll have realtors calling me saying, 
we can tell. I've got a transaction coordinator that checks on these loans every couple of days on our listings, and she'll say, hey, there's a problem. That lender's not calling me back. I'll rattle the cage. I'll call looking for the boss. They call me back, and, and I can tell when they don't call me, that means there's something wrong. And I, I just tell the realtor, hey, look, um, you're out of loan commitment. Um, I'm only extending this for you. Um, you can back out of the contract now. We're going to get back on the market. I've got backup offers, and your buyer can go away. We'll give them back their deposit. Or go to the loan arranger. They'll figure out what the loan problem is. If there's a loan, you let me know. Absolutely. And you rescue those. You know, and it's funny because I get calls every day from people that were pre-approved, and then I look at it, and I'm like, oh, man, you got some things that need, you need to back out of this contract. Let's fix the problem. And then we'll go back into another contract. And then others, the client says, I've been to three mortgage companies. I couldn't get approved. And then they come to me and I get them closed. And, and here's the reason I don't have overlays, meaning that's additional restrictions that lenders have on their loans. I don't have any of those. I underwrite to Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac and HUD guidelines. That's it. I specialize in VA loans. I specialize with first time home buyers. I got the most, most amazing jumbo products. Oh, I promised you I was going to talk about my jumbo product. Now listen to this, Cleve. Okay. No, no money down. Here, here, yeah. It's darn near no money down on a jumbo. So a jumbo is a loan that's exceeding $625,000. I'll do a mortgage up to a million five with three and a half percent down interest rates in the threes, no PMI. I will show you why you should keep your money in the market and get that loan. Now, here's the thing. You got to have pretty good credit to get it. Yeah. You have to have substantial cash reserves. That's money that you have to show me that you have, yep. but you don't have to spend. I'm going to show you how to grow your money much faster by leveraging my money than using your own. All you got to do is pick up the phone and call me at 407-250-9144. That's 407-250-9144. Or go to my website, the easiest online application in the world on the planet, we bring you I'm home. in the process. Com. Yeah, I'm in the process right now. And it's just, it's just so simple, Bruce. I want to be ready. I've got, um, you know, I just, I, I like being able to, if I see something I like, I want to be able to go get it. Sure. Another investment. And now's the time for self-employed people to yeah. have me analyze their previous taxes that before too. you go filing. Before you tell your, your accountant, yes, that's it. Put it, you know, lock right? it in. Make sure you talk to Bruce if you're thinking about refinancing or buying. Um, because you all like to say, well, you know, write off a few more business expenses, but you, it's got to make sense. It's got to make sense. So, but I can help guide you in the right direction. I do this with folks all the time. I'll review your tax returns. If you're self-employed, 1099 subcontractor, let me take a look at them so I can guide you in the direction. So you don't come to me in May and go, yeah, I filed my 2021, Bruce. Great. Uh, send me over your tax returns. Hey, Bruce, I just want to warn you in advance. I have a really good yep. CPA. Yep. As soon as you say that, here's what you're here's what you're doing. You're making good money. You're not showing that you're making any money, so you don't pay any taxes. Yep. And then you wonder why you don't qualify for traditional financing. Let me help you. Now, for those of you that don't care about traditional financing, but you still want a good loan, you can leave your tax returns at home. I don't even want to see them. I'll get you a loan based on your bank statement deposits only. Just call the loan arranger. I've got every loan program for residential mortgages that you could possibly think of, including renovation loans, construction perm loans, the best in the business, 407-250-9144 or webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. Cleve, People could reach you at 407 352 8118. What else love, we got? Lovelandreport.com. I just want to talk about, once again, this time of year, great time to look. Uh, we can get you in the new year, new home by the new year. And uh, I am seeing some listings, Bruce. It'll be interesting to see next month listing numbers. I think they're going to climb a little bit because what I'm seeing, I'm taking listings that were on the market for 60 or 90 days. And the, the sellers are calling me going, I don't know what's going on, but I haven't sold. I heard this market's on fire. And when I go look at them, it's the marketing, it's the staging, um, and then some of it is the the pricing. You've got to make sense. And and I say pigs get fat, hogs, hogs get, slaughtered. get slaughtered. If your neighbors, you know, you got a five hundred thousand dollar house, your neighbors are selling for four seventy five to five hundred. You don't list for five ninety nine if your house is about the same. Now you've got special stuff and you've got gold plated fixtures. We'll go through all that when I do the market analysis on your home. 
but you're better off to list it for say five twenty five and get on there. You know, and, and it's just it, it's well, you, you not only know that, the market. when you list your property, and I see you doing this all the time. If you list a property at a, a market value, a good price, you're going to get more people coming in. You're going to get more people making offers. Then the seller can say, <clears throat> you know what? I marketed my house at 500. I've got five offers. And now I can ask for highest can, highest and best offer. Yeah. Well, right. and also what makes it, every, you know, this is the reason you can't just click on a button and get your house sold. You can, but the you won't like the price. What's your situation? Do you need a lease back from the buyer? Have you already bought your other home? Are you in a hurry? Are you not in a hurry? Have you got six months? What's the best time? Your new home's not completed yet. I handle all that for you. And I can tell you the best times to do this, the risk and rewards, the trials and tribulations we might have along the way, but solve those problems for you. And that's what, that's what you can't get talking to a call center in Bombay. Well, that's what you, yeah, that's for sure. And that's not what you get. You get the real deal with Cleve because he does care about helping you save money when it comes to selling your home. Get the most for the value. These I companies that you see on, on, on their commercials are spending millions of dollars on these commercials. I'm going to tell you right now, their commercials are fantastic. The results that you get when you hear these companies going, Oh yeah, it was seamless process. No, you, we don't care about the appraisal, the inspection. We'll just go in. You don't need anybody coming through your house. Do you really think you're getting market value for that home? No, no, no. You're, you're, you're giving up a big chunk of change because they're going to re either put lipstick on it, try and resell it for more and, or possibly put it into a rental portfolio. So, and it's funny, I have seen, you know, when I list a property, uh, let's say under, under 500,000, I get probably two or three uh, offers from those hedge funds and some of the iBuyer companies. And they are usually, um, they usually they're most of the time they are in my spam folder. I will look at them just for laughs, but they are, they are literally there 25 to 35% below. And I'll, I'll let them know that, Hey, multiple offers, your offer stinks. If you want to make it better, great. And they send me a big, long, nice email about how they're, oh, they're willing, you know, if the seller changes their mind, I'm like, well, I don't think the seller's going to want to give up that much equity. Goodbye. So that's what you're hiring a realtor for. The MLS is what works. The MLS is what gets people through. And a good listing agent is going to negotiate the best price. It's for actually you. the best marketing tool for anything I've ever seen ever. Like there's no other industry that has something that creative as the auto MLS. trader might be close, but that's about it. Maybe, maybe, maybe you're yeah. right. But yeah. as far as the detail, and it's basically an MLS. Re, well, actually, system. yeah, you know what? Auto Trader's not even close. You got the record keeping. I can right. go back and see the last five homes when the neighbor when and when my the seller's saying, "Wait a minute, you're saying five fifty on this house." My neighbor just sold for six fifty. I right. can go in there. We can look at the pictures and see. Oh wow, okay, he just had a total renovation done and a three hundred thousand dollar resort style pool out back. So this is where we need to be. Plus, he had an extra thousand square feet. You know? Speaking of resort style pools, if you're interested in new construction and you want me to connect you with my very favorite builder, local builder, local family, Hanover family builders, pay your closing costs using the loan arranger. The, they will take the best care of you as a builder of any production builder that I've seen anywhere in the market period. I'll put my name on it. I'll sign a letter to it. They're the best. They, they care about their realtors. They care about their clients. They care about you during construction and post construction. A lot of these big builders, as soon as you sign the contract, they turn into the devil people. Like you can't reach them. They're, they're like, Oh no, that's in the contract. That's boilerplate. You can't change that. You can't do this. You're signed the contract. We're committed. We'll keep your escrow. You know what? Use a builder that's got a great reputation. Somebody that I endorse, and that's Hanover Family Builders. I can connect you with my folks at Hanover. Just call me at 407-250-9144, 407-250-9144, or webringyouhome.com. Or you can contact Cleve at 407 352 8118. That's 352 8118. Or lovelandreport.com. Yep. We'll be back in five minutes with more of the Loveland Report and the Lone Arranger Radio Show. Stay tuned.